How you doing? It's Solace Kingdom, that kingdom forth here. But guys, I love you, God. When they see me, let them see you. When they hear me, let them hear you, Father God. In Jesus' name, God, <clears throat> we pray. But this is a prosperity prayer out of the prayer book, volume one prayer, that availed much from Copeland, from Jermaine Copeland. But it's a prosperity. I prayed another prosperity prayer, but this one is for prosperity for ministering service. So, so if you're out there ministering, you know, the people for the Lord, this is a good prayer to pray. I'm going to pray it because God is leading me to, and I got to do what he tells me to do. Even if I don't feel like it, that's what obedience is. You got to do it when he says it because it's, it's, you have to, guys. It's a reward for your obedience, guys. It's, obedience is better than sacrifice. But here's the prayer. Father, how we praise you and thank you for your word. Excuse me. Knowing that you watch over your word to perform it, and no word of yours returns void, but accomplishes that which you pleases, and it, pro it please, and it prospers in the thing for which you sent it. Father, in the name of Jesus, we pray and believe that those in your body who have sown the seed of spiritual good among the people reap from the people's material benefits. For you directed that those who publish the good news of the gospel should live and get their maintenance by the gospel. The people's gifts are the fragrant odor of an offering and sacrifice which you, Father, welcome and in which you delight. You will liberally supply, fill to the full, the people's every need according to your riches and glory in Christ Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Father, it is your will that those who receive instruction in the word of God shall, in the word of God, share all good things with their teachers contributing to their support. We confess that your people will not lose heart and grow weary and faint and acting nobly and doing right. For in due time and at the right appointed season, they, they shall reap if they do not loosen and relax their courage and faint. So then as, a, as occasion and opportunity are open to the people, they do good to all people, not only being useful and profitable to them, but also doing what is for their spiritual good and advantage. We pray that your people will be a blessing, especially to those of the household of faith, those who belong to God's family. Help us to remember that whoever sows generously will also reap generously. God, you are then able to make all grace, every favor and earthly blessing come to your people in abundance so that they are always in under all circumstances, possessing enough to require no aid or support and furnish in abundance for every good work and charitable donation. As your people give their deeds of justice and goodness and kindness and benevolence, go on and endure forever. And God, you provide the seed for the sower and bread for the eating. So you also will provide and multiply the people's resources for sowing and increasing the fruits of their righteousness. Thus, your people are enriched in all things and in every way so that they can be generous and their generosity as it is administered by your teachers will, be, will bring thanksgiving to God. As it is written, give and it shall be given unto you. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over shall men give into your bosom. Luke 638. Praise the Lord in Jesus name. Amen. But guys, I want you to watch this over and over again and listen to that prayer because it's an awesome prayer. And guys, I love you. God bless and just give thanks to the Lord because he is good and his mercy and just forever. What's up, Kyle? My cousin on here and everybody watching all around the world. It's solid kingdom there. King the fourth. I'm blessed. I'm prosperous, I'm thankful, I'm wealthy, I'm healthy, I'm successful, I'm a winner, I'm a champion, I always accomplish my goals. Watch this prayer again, guys, I love you, and keep fighting the good fight of faith. No matter what, we're winners. God bless. Take care.